Hello everyone. I had to practice this a couple of times because I just call him Laura all the time. But we had Israel Landi versus Alvarez. Raymond Alvarez. Uh we're gonna jump straight into it. But before we jump straight into it, don't forget to smash the like button, share and subscribe, and let's go on. First round, both men come out trying to control the fight with their lead hands. And Israelandi is kind of sneaky. He's going to try to take that lead foot and put it to the outside of the orthodox fighter, trying to take the lead foot dominance. And he's going to get countered, but I think he also lands the jab too. That right there was a beautiful counter for Trey Alvarez. So Laura goes back to keeping him at distance with that long jab of his. Pay attention to Alvarez's lead foot. He's going to take lead foot dominance, but he's going to be a little slow on that trigger. It has to be hand and feet working together at the same time, or at least know your opponent's time. Look at this. Whoops. Too slow on the trigger. And uh, Israel Lari, Israel Landi gets away. And then returns something else. Pay attention to this next scene as Laura shoots a straight jab to the head as a fake, and then goes to the body with a straight left, I should say. Alvarez, not to be outdone, tries to retaliate by going back to the body, but it receives a hook for his troubles, a right hook, that is. Alvarez, in desperation, changes levels, skips slow, and starts attacking Israel Andi, uh lethargically and only gets countered for all his troubles. As we take it into the second round, Laura is shooting a lazy probing jab. And Alvarez goes underneath and starts going through the body, making it rough in there. He's trying to take Laura out, or at least regain some confidence. Receives a body shot. Israel Andi backs up. Notice how Alvarez keeps on dropping his hands. He gets countered over the top. And that's it. Three left hands. Alvarez is clearing his head with 1 minute and 24 seconds left on the clock. Wait, he's backing straight up with his head still in the same spot. He's making a mistake. What happens if he gets swarmed by Lalora since he just got knocked down? Alvarez needs to move his head. He's got his head in one spot. Oh, what a big left by Lalora. Yeah. Oh, I think he says that. I think he's done. YouTubers, if you like my content, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe. That way, I keep on bringing you more content. Have a nice night.